What's up guys, it's Nate from the Pwn Devs team, and just a couple minutes ago, my best friend and also one of the team leaders, Phil, has recu recruited Corti. Uh, he is the developer of UI settings, and now is an official member of the Pwn Devs team. We would all want to send big welcome, and thanks for all your hard work in development in UI settings, and welcome to the team once again. Well, UI settings is a tweak that is pretty much the SB settings for Notification Center. It is has a better interface, it works great in Notification Center, and I'm pretty much just going to jump right into this and show you how it works. So first off, you need to open Obsidia, and for right now he has it on his repository, but I believe it's going to be on the Pwn Dev Team repository here real soon. His repo is cake dot Q W E R T Y O R U I O P dot com slash Cydia. Don't worry, you don't have to pause the video and try to rush to install it because I'm going to leave it in the description down below, of course. Well, once you download that, you also want to download US Prefs. What that does is it allows you to uh, deal with your toggles for this tweak. All right. Now, let's go ahead and get into this. Once you download UI settings, your device will respring, and you will need to go into your settings application, click on notification, and you will need to enable UI settings. Alright, UI settings is in the notification center, so go ahead and swipe down, and here I have my toggles. I have Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, Location, Airplane, Brightness, Volume, Respring, Safe Mode, Power Off, and Reboot. This was one of the first tweaks that came out in iOS 5, and it's just getting better and better. Now he has these page scrolling features for this actual widget, and now has a little smoother interface. You see how that window just pops down and expands, and it just looks great. To respring, you get a little window and you can tap on the blue arrow and it will respring. It's just kind of fun to use, easy to use, and very convenient to use whenever you are in an application, say I'm in my settings application, want to respring real fast, go ahead, click on respring. That is UI settings since he is now, I believe, on core 7 or 8 of this. Um, it has made huge improvements since beta 2 of it. So this is now one of my favorite widgets along with BB Settings, another widget that is optimized for iOS 5 made by uh, another Pwn Dev, Dev team member called Manuel. Well, with US Prefs that you downloaded after UI Settings, it allows you to pretty much change the order of your widget, uh, sorry, your toggles, and it allows you to turn certain ones off. So since this is the tethered jailbreak, I am going to turn off, power off, and reboot. I never use the volume one. And that is it. The ones that I like to use the most are going to be put to the top. So I'll have respring as first. I'll have airplane as third. Wi-Fi will be second. And we will put brightness as the fourth. So respring, Wi-Fi, airplane mode, and brightness will be on the first page. Once you have set it up as your preferences, you will respring and slide to unlock. Swipe down your notification center, and there my widgets have been. Sorry, I keep saying widgets. My toggles have been rearranged. So, pretty much, that's UI settings and US Prefs uh, made by one of our developers, Cordy. Uh, I, don't, I don't know how to pronounce his username, so I'll leave that in the description below to, with a link to his Twitter page. And just a big warm welcome from everybody in the Pwn Dev team to you, Cordy. Thank you very much for all your hard work. Uh, everybody who's been watching this video, make sure you please rate and comment down below and subscribe up top. See ya.